Okay, assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. So good day again everyone. So now we will be discussing complex fractions in this kind of given po. Okay, so in this complex fraction or in any other complex fraction that will sh uh, show you multiple nested fractions, meaning marami po kayong fractions within your given, um, what you call this, the main fraction bar. Okay, maraming fraction within the main fraction bar. What you simply need to do here and to simply understand on any given po is you have to evaluate first. Paliitin niyo muna, simplify, make it smaller, the smallest fraction bar. Okay, so you have to look at your given. Which one has the smallest fraction bar? And you ask yourself, can I make this simpler? Okay, so on this given, let's take a look at the, uh, um, the smallest fraction bar, which is this one. You ask yourself, can I make this thing big any smaller? Can I make this thing any simpler? And if the answer is yes, then please do so. So in this case, there's a small fraction bar and there's an addition. And of course, you can add that one. You can add it using the addition of any given fraction. Po. Okay, so this is, let's use the orange one. So that's 2 plus x over t. Okay, and adding this one will give me this following. Um operation over 1 and this is t 2t plus x all over t so meaning this given this um let's just select this one this given the one in the circle or this one 2 plus x over t it will be changed as let's just change it already as 2t plus x over Oh, sorry. The fraction bar is the whole one. Okay. Plus x over t. Okay? You will notice yung t ko medyo inaartihan ko. Para hindi siya medyo iturong plus lang talaga. Okay? Now, you proceed to the next fraction bar. So, you look at the smallest fraction bar. Ito yung smallest fraction bar. Pero wala ka nang pwedeng gawin dyan. So, you have to look at the next one. Looking at the next one, this one. Let's use another color pala. At the next one, you can ask yourself, can I still simplify this one? I bet I can kasi I can simplify this one by just simply applying the rule of the complex fraction wherein it's just division of fraction. Okay, so let's using the blue ink. So let's have 2 divided by 2t plus x all over t. Adding, um, cross multiplying this one kasi tayo ay again nasa um, complex fraction, i-reciprocate ko yan. So it will provide me with the given of 2 over 1 times reciprocated 1 t over 2 t plus x giving you 2 t all over 2 t plus x so this case in this case this given the one in the circle the blue circle we can replace this one by our answer which is our answer is just simply 2 t all over 2 t plus x okay so on, on, on this one you have to look at the smallest fraction bar so this is this one so you ask yourself can you still simplify this further if not therefore you will see no other fraction there okay wala ka nang makikita fraction or it's not a complex fraction this uh, blue one okay then you proceed to the next given okay on the next given is this one. Yan. Unti-unti inyo, boys. Okay? Unti-unti in natin. Therefore, the on that given, we can still subtract this one, right? We can subtract that one. And subtracting that one will give us this one. Let's use the green ink. Let's circle this one. Kasi this is what we will be doing. Okay? So, we have 2 minus 2t two all over 2t plus x. It will give me the following answer cross multiply, I will multiply immediately po. 2 times 2t plus x, the answer is 4t plus 2x okay, minus, parenthesis tayo kasi meron tayong binomial na, minus 1 times 2t is simply 2t, all over 2t plus x, okay? So having this one, what we need to do here is we need to simplify further, because kasi if I will remove the parentheses, okay, and I will change the sign of this one, kasi 
remember I told you the only remove the parenthesis if and only if your operation is addition na. So this is actually plus plus negative 2p kasi chinesya natin yung sign niya. These are the same um the same what they call this same terms 4t and negative 2t. Since the other one is negative it's just simply 4t minus 2t. And the answer there would simply be Ayan. It would simply be 2t plus 2x over 2t plus x. Okay? Yan na yung ano, simplified for niya. Okay? It's a little bit complicated. Yes. Pero if you will break it down um, into smaller parts, it's actually quite easy lang naman. So you just have to follow the steps that I am doing. Okay? So after you have simplified further, what you need to do is you replace the one in the green circle with our current answer and our current answer is just simply we just write on down in green it's 2t 2x plus 2x all over 2t plus x i believe so it's that one yes okay so having this one okay you uh, go to the next fraction bar, okay? Which is, of course, this one. Ito na yung susunod natin. So, let's use a, a brown uh, marker there. I will solve here on the other side na lang. Okay? On this side. Para hindi tayo masyadong bumaba. Okay? So, this would be 2 all over 2t plus 2x. Habaan natin yung fraction bar kasi baka mali po kayo. Okay? All over 2t plus x. Division na naman po. So, this would simply be 2 divided by reciprocate na natin. So, i-multiply na natin agad. Over 1. Reciprocate. It's 2t plus x over 2t plus 2x. Okay? Multiplying this one will give you, of course, 4t plus 2x all over 2t plus 2x. Okay? So, we have this given now. We can simplify this one actually. Okay, this one can be simplified by using the division, I, I mean, sorry, factoring po. Okay, ang factor po ng taas is 2 times 2t plus x. And ang factor po ng nasa baba is just simply 2, sorry, 2 times t plus x. Okay, paano po nangyari yun? Kasi pag minultiply po natin, when we multiply 2 times 2t, the answer will be 4t. And if we multiply, of course, 2 times x, the answer would be 2x. So, with this, um, we factored it out. And same goes, 2 times t is 2t, and 2 times x is 2x. Okay? And then we cancel out the 2, giving us a final answer for the brown one, 2t plus x over t plus x. Okay? So, papalitan, we need to replace our brown one, with our current answer sorry let me with our current answer of we delete this one of 2t plus x t over x so it's 2t plus x over um, what you call, what's that t plus x and lastly we need to and not lastly pala next one this one naman okay let's answer this one using our yellow marker okay let's answer it here on the side let's zoom out a little bit so i can see the given and write it down it's 2 plus 2t let me write it down properly na lang. okay 2 plus 2 over 1 yan 2t plus x all over p plus x equals to what let's try to solve okay so cross multiply ulit direct ko na okay so, it's 2t plus 2x kasi minultiply ko na agad. And then, i-add natin yan dito. So, meron tayong plus 2t plus x all over t plus x kasi direct multiply yan. Okay? So, on this one, sa taas, pagsasamahin natin itong mga similar term. So, this would give us 4t plus 3x all over t plus Okay. So, ito, papalitan natin ng ating kulay yellow. 
and oh I I think I hope I can select this one okay that's good so this one we replace it by our yellow answer giving us 40 3x so it's 40 plus 3x all over our t plus x okay so if we have this given the next thing we do is yung huli ng step which is of course we apply the final complex fraction which is just division of fraction divided by 40 plus 3x over t plus x giving us an answer of cross multiplication lang po yan okay um, 2t sige isulat na lang natin ng maayos para hindi kayo malito this would be 2 over 1 times reciprocated form this one 40 plus 3x and multiplying this one direct na na po natin i-multiply distributive property 2 times t and 2 times x giving us 2t plus 2x all over mababa, madali na lang 40 plus 3x okay so, and then finally you ask yourself can I still simplify this one can I factor out this one okay because simplification is just merely factoring knowing how to factor if you cannot factor this out then finally this is your final answer yes it's a little bit complicated but that's why I broke it down into simpler parts so that you will understand okay so you have to what uh, be mindful of the different color schemes that i used and just review the video based on that okay so i do hope that you got our um, example for today we will be providing um, some examples during our synchronous classes thank you everyone for listening and assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh